Have you tried to download a video and it takes time to download? Today you will learn how to optimize your videos to be smaller but keep the quality intact for many devices. In the past few weeks I've been teaching online using Zoom and recording my sessions with my students. I added the videos and removed any dead air, the ahs, the ums, and adding relevant notes to the video. When it's time to export the videos to a video format, they are huge. YouTube, Vimeo, Instagram, or Facebook, they're all going to transcode and compress your uploaded video. This is unavoidable, but it's also necessary to ensure your video plays back smoothly online. With online course platforms such as Thinkorific, Udemy, and Skillshare, they don't compress your videos for their platforms. It's strongly recommended you compress your videos as larger video files can load slowly for any students who are over a slow internet connection. I use an application called Handbrake, a free tool that you can use to compress your video without reducing the quality of the video. This application is available for free, open source for either Windows, Macs, and Linux. Convert video from nearly any format. Go to the website and download from Handbrake themselves. When you open Handbrake, you have two options. One choice is to search and select the video to get started in compressing your video. Or you can click on cancel and you will see color bars in the software. What I normally do, I drag and drop my video inside the color bars. In my example, my file for final project walkthrough is 736 megabytes. You can see many different file formats for the web, video, phones, to TV, and production as a compression tool. But you can go in depth with chapters, filters to change the final size and adding subtitles. I typically leave the default settings to my videos and only change it to be very fast, 1080p 30. It's fast and compatible across a wide range of software and devices. After I choose the file format that I need to upload and share with my students, Handbrake starts to encode the video at the bottom with an ETA time when it will be finished. After a file is optimized, the file size is reduced by 83% and is now 123 megabytes. Having video optimized for online courses such as Thinkorific will download quickly on a mobile, tablet, or desktop. But probably the most important value here is the student will appreciate the smaller videos too. Thanks everyone for watching. If you have any issues, please let me know in the comments. If you enjoyed the video, like it, share it, and subscribe to the channel. And I will see you next time.